Hi, my name is Lori, and I've uh, been living in Naples for the past 10 years. I'm originally from Oklahoma, uh, but I moved around a lot because of my job. I'm an airline pilot, um, so eventually, like a lot of people, ended up being transplanted here and found Naples about a decade ago, yeah, 10 years now, and uh, I'm here forever. I love Naples, and I'm never leaving. I love it here. My dream home was always going to be like a, a nice little cottage that I could fix up. Kimberly was actually my neighbor about three homes down and that's how we first met 10 years ago uh, in my original home that I bought when I moved to Naples. We didn't know each other well and uh, I knew she was a real estate professional but I didn't, I didn't pursue that uh, business relationship with her at first. I sold my last two homes FISBO for sale by owner because I was not uh, a big fan of real estate professionals at that time. Uh, but at that time when I decided to uh, sell my house, it was right when the market was beginning to crash here in Naples and the whole bubble in the real estate thing. And it was a really, really bad time to try and sell a home. But I just knew that if I was ever going to make the move and get into the neighborhood I really loved, then it was time to do something. So I took a chance on Kimberly and uh, we signed up and uh, never look back. I, I don't think we have enough time to actually talk about how wonderful she is and everything she did for me with that transaction. Uh, given the market at the time, she actually sold my home pretty quickly, actually quicker than I expected to in such a horribly down market. And over the years of living here, I found Naples Park, you know, kind of a more traditional, you know, kids still trick-or-treat and ride their bikes in the streets kind of place. That was really what I wanted. Um, one night I was just driving around and drove, uh, drove past a house and caught my eye and that was it. I knew that was the house and I called up Kimberly and I said, well the good news is I found my house. The bad news is, is not only is it a distress sale, it's a short sale, drama, banks, PMI companies. It's not going to be easy at all. So the good news is I found it. The bad news is, is you can have to really get to work now. <laughs> There were three times I can remember that the deal almost fell apart and Kimberly fixed it. She was on the phone, she, I don't even, I don't even know how she did what she did, but she made it work. Uh, we even had to completely redo all the contracts two days before closing. I mean, that's how involved with it she was. Um, I would never have been able to complete the purchase of this home without her. I, it wouldn't have happened. She, she made it happen, really. Uh, quick and dirty story. My little brother is going to retire uh, in my neighborhood someday here in Naples Park with me, but it's going to be another four years. Um, as you know, the prices have just skyrocketed in the last year or two. So uh, we got a little proactive, and Kimberly helped me uh, find another home about a block from here to buy. Uh, and the cool thing about this is, Kimberly, she uh, this was all on the sly. Nobody knew I was buying this home. My brother didn't know. Uh, nobody knew. Kimberly helped me do this in stealth mode. She, uh, she helped me find a place, we closed on it. Uh, nobody was the wiser. Uh, and we even, after I bought the thing and closed on the house, we even were able to do, thanks to Kimberly, do the big reveal, um, you know, worthy of a TV show. It was awesome. So anyway, so just very, very recently, she helped me buy another place here in Naples Park. Uh, so we'll rent it out for now, but it's gonna be for my brother when he retires in four years.